ವಂದೆ ಗುರುಪದ್ವಂದ ಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಸಮನ್ವಿತ ಶ್ರೀಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ವಂದೆ ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದಸೋದಿತ ಶ್ರೀ ನಂದನಂದನಂಗ ವಂದೆ ರಾಧಿಕಾ ಚರಣೋದಯ ಗೋಪೀಜನ ಸಾಯುಕ್ತ ಬಿಂದಾವನ ಮನೋಹರ ವಾಂಛಾಕಲ್ಪತರು ವಶ ಕಿ ಪಾಸಿಂದ ಬವಚ ಅತಿಂಗ ಪಾವನೇಭ್ಯ ವೈಷ್ಣವೀಭ್ಯೋ ನಮೋ ನಮ ಮೂಕಂಕರೋತಿ ವಾಚಾಲಂಕಂಗುಂಗ್ಲಂಘಯತಿ ಗಿರಿ ಯತ್ ಕಿ ಪಾತಮಹಂಗ ವಂದಿ ಪರಮಾನಂದಮಾಧವ ಬೃಂದಾವೈ ತುಳಸಿದೇವೈ ಪಿಯಾ ವೈ ಕೇಶವ ಶ್ನಭಕ್ತಿಪದೆ ದೇವಿ ಸತ್ವತ್ವೈ ನಮೋ ನಮಃ ನಾರಾಯಣ ನಮಸ್ಕೃತ ನುರಂಚ ನುರುತ್ತಮ ದೇವೀಂ ಸರಸ್ವತೀ ವ್ಯಾಸ ತಥೋ ಜಯೋ ಮುದೀರ ಸಂಕೀರ್ತನೆ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಕಥೋಪದೇಶ ಗೌರೀಯ ಪಾತ್ರಶ ಪ್ರಕಾಶನೆ ಸದಾನುರಕ್ತ ಗುರುಭಕ್ತಿಯುಕ್ತ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಪ್ರಮದಾಕ್ಷ ಜಗೋದ್ವರಣ್ಯ ಧೈಯ ಸದಾ ಪರಿಭವಗ್ನಮಿಷ್ಟೂಹಂ ತೀರ್ಥಾಸ್ಪದ ಶಿವಭಿರಂಚನ ತಂ ಶರಣ್ಯ ಬೀತಾತ್ಯಹಂ ಪುನತಪಾಲ್ಭವಾಧಿಪೂತ ವಂದೇ ಮಹಾಪುರುಷ ತೇ ಚರಣಾರವಿಂದ ಯತ್ ಪಾದಪಲ್ಲವನಕಚಂದಮನಿ ಛಟಾಯ ವಿಸ್ಫುರಜೀತ ಕಿಮಿ ಗೋಧೂಷು ಅದರ್ಶ ಪೂರ್ಣಾನುರಾಗರ ಸಸಾಗರ ಸಾರಮೂರ್ತಿ ಸಾರಾಧಿ ಕಾಮೈ ಕದಾಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಸಿಯಾತ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಶ್ರೀಕೃಷ್ಣ ಚೈತನ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭು ನಿತ್ಯಾನಂದ ಸಿಯಾದ್ವೈತಗದಾಧರ ಶಿವ ಸದೀ ಗೌ ಗೌರಭಕ್ತವಿಂದ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಆಜಾನುಲಂಬಿತುಜ ಕನಕಾಬುಧಾತ ಸಂಕೇತನೈಕರು ಕಮಲಾಯುತಾಕ್ಷ ವಿಶಾಂಬರೋದಿಯವರು ಜುಗಧಾರ್ಮಪಾಲೋ ವಂದೇ ಜಗತ್ ಪ್ರಿಯಕರು ಕರುಣಾವತಾರು ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ ನಮಿ ಗಂಗೇ ತವ ಪಾದ ಪಂಕಜ ಸುರಾಸುರೈರ್ವಂದಿತೋ ದಿವ್ಯೂಪ ಭಕ್ತಿ ಮುಕ್ತಿ ದಾಸಿತ್ಯ ಭಾವಾನುಪೇಣ ಸದಾ ನರಾನ ಗಂಗಾತರಂಗರಮಣೀಯಜಟಾಕಲಾಪ ಗೌರೀ ನಿರಂತರ ವಿಭೂಷಿತ ವಾಮ ಭಾಗ ನಾರಾಯಣ ಪ್ರಿಯಮನಂಗಮದಾಪಹಾರ ವಾರಾಣಸಿ ಪುರಪತಿ ಭಜ ವೀಶ್ವನಾಥ ವಾಗೀಶಜುಷ ವದನೆ ಲಕ್ಷ್ಮೀರ್ಜಸ್ ಚ ವಕ್ಷಸಿ ಯಸ್ತಿ ಹೃದಯ ಸಂಬೀ ತ್ಸಿಂಗಮಹಂ ಭಜಿ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ ಹರೇ ಕೃಷ್ಣ 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 ಹರೇ 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 ರಾಮ ಹರೇ ರಾಮ 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 ಹರೇ ಹರೇ 
आश्चर्यमेताधिमनस्लोके सुधा परितज्य विषम पिबंती नारायण गोचरा त्याच बच कुहको कुहका पठंती आश्चर्यमेताधिमनुस्लोके सुधा परितज्य विषम पिबंती नमा नारायण गोचरा त्याच कुहका पटंती गौरीय गोष्ठीपति शिशिल वक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी डॉक्टर प्रभात जगदगुरु स्पीकिंग हाउ टू गेट हाउ टू गेट रीड ऑफ दिस मेटेरियल लाइफ हाउ टू गेट रीड ऑफ दिस मेटेरियल लाइफ गौरी गोष्ठीपति श्री श्री भक्ति सिद्धांत सरस्वती गोस्वामी ठाकुर पोपा जगदगुरु स्पीकिंग हाउ टू गेट रीड ऑफ दिस मेटेरियल संसार दिस काइंड ऑफ टेंडेंसी ऑलवेज देयर इन साइड एवरी बॉडी एक्चुअली नोइंगली अनोइंगली दे आर सर्चिंग फॉर एंजॉयमेंट बट दे डोंट नो what is the definition of actual enjoyment that is the main problem knowingly unknowingly everybody is searching for enjoyment but they have no actual definition they don't know the actual definition of enjoyment that's why they are in problem all the time sila bhava speaking this material world how you can look this material world from different points of view over speaking for material people for them proper speaking that just like when you know hunter going to catch elephant you know the tactics guru patod me used to speak this you know if like to if that hunter like to catch elephant then it is not so easy then they will have to make one big you know dig one big land they have to dig after that with very you know bamboo structure and very you know like straw and you know they make a false road and they they allow a sea elephant to run and is one kind of provocation so the elephant going to catch that you know to get the association of that sea elephant now they arrange in such a way that the elephant cannot go that way to make shortcut elephant going to run through that false road whenever elephant going to put leg immediately elephant become in a trap in the dig you know ditch this way proba speaking this material world apparently very nice full of enjoyment maya devi going to decorate all market where you can get sabdo sparsho roop ras gandho all you can get maya devi making a big market whatever you need according to your sanskar and test you can go and enjoy who is going to stop you this way proba speaking always try to look this material world like a false a uh, false road which is just made up of you know straw and you know light bamboo structure is this so jiva they become a, in the clutcher of mind they are in trap so proba speaking we must be very careful and those who want to become devotee sincerely for them proba saying you must watch this whole world as the item of seva of krishna whole world you can see it is not for your enjoyment you can look the whole world 
decorated all and everything, whatever you watch, what you, whatever you cannot watch, you know, all you should think, all, uh, all are the items for the seva of Bhagavan, Nandanan and Krishna, Bhagavan, Sri Krishna. It's very, 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 very difficult. If we fall down in material samsara heavily, like, like the elephant, Jivatma is also like elephant, you know, like Gajendra Mokshan, you know, there. We are all in trap, more or less. So somehow we'll have to, you know, come out of the trap. Without Bhagavad Kipa, I mean, without the Kipa of pure Guru Vaishnava, it is impossible to come out of this material samsara without kipa. Naishang mati stavat urukramanghin speshati anarthap gamaha yatartho mahi asam padara jau visekham niskin chananam na brinito javad. You can never mana palladma speak. Naishang mati stavat urukramanghin. Sprishyattanarthap gamo yadartho mahi asam padarajo visekam niskinchananam na brinito yavat na esangmati na esangmati stabat urukramangi spishi. You can never make any. You can never understand about Bhagavad Tattva. Impossible. Na esangmati stabat urukramangi. If you can take bath by the dust particle from the lotus feet of pure Guru Vishnu, then your, you know, intellect can try to understand, otherwise not. Without the keeper of Bhagavan, I mean, without the keeper of Guru Vishnu, by personal effort, nobody can come out of this trap. Nate vidu svartha gatim hi vishnum durasa yajid vihirartha manim andhaya thandhi rupaniya manam teya pisichatanta murudam nivadya. This is law. We are the servant of Krishna that we forget, so we are bound to you know, jump into the ocean of Maya. There is no other way. How to lead life? Somebody asking to Prabhupada. Well, you will have to lead your life with full concentration in Harikatha. Which kind of Harikatha? Which is coming? A kind of Harikatha which is coming out from the lotus mouth of a pure devotee. If contamination is there, he, if, he, if the sadhu is not realized so, then you cannot get uh, a, a such big result. No. Follow. Baba speaking, suggesting you will have to hear Harikatha with full attention. Not that we are hearing with full attention. Like one man become hungry for two, three days not eating. He is thirsty and hungry. Then how you can expect that man can do? Similarly, Baba speaking, that you will have to hear from a pure sadhu is a realized soul, a gone hearing, and whole world you can look as all, all other item of Krishna Seva. This way, gradually, you can go out of problem. There can be no, you know, pain and pleasure feeling cannot touch you. Sometimes pain, sometimes pleasure. Material pleasure, material enjoyment, all of This way, Baba speaking with full attention, Utkarno. Utkarno means, in Benu Gita, long ago, three, four years, I mean three years back I was speaking, that those Gomata, those small calf and Gomata, they are hearing that, you know, Hearing the sound of Bhangshit Dhani, they are hearing Krishna praying of the fruits and they are hearing and it is written there 
all calf, you know, stonopaya kabala. It is written, they are hearing that the Bhangshi Dhani with full attention, as if they are going to drink the nectar in the form of sound by the help of the glass. Their ear, Gomata, their ear, you know, if they make it straight, you know, then it is like glass, like glass. So they are, you know, taking the juice of that Bangsi Dhaniya, they are going to drink with full attention the calf, you know, those calf, they forget to, forget to take milk from the breast of Ma, you know, Gomata. They, they stop taking milk from the, you know, breast of Gomata. Now they stop and hear me, as if by the help of the glass, glass is come, you know, their ear is compared with glass, full straight, they are making it straight, you know, up. So you are hearing. Baba speaking, this way you will have to hear. So, this way we will have to hear Harikatha with full attention. Though we know most of the jivas, they are Bahir Bahirmuk, they are averse to Krishna, but shortly they can realize something. This way, they can try their best. Main problem is that, Prabhupada speaking, actually we are the servant of Bhagavan, Supreme Lord, but we like to give service to Bhagavan. We like to become master. We want to get service from Bhagavan. That is the main problem. We never think Bhagavan is, you know, is our, you know, life and soul. We like to serve. We like. But we think that we are master. We want to engage Bhagavan Sri Krishna to fulfill our desire. This way, we can never come out successfully. Prabhupada repeatedly speaking, Bhagavan is Purnavastu, Jiva not Purnavastu, that's why dissatisfaction, you know, agitation, all is there. But the Jeeva, when can get in connection with that Purnavastu? Purnavastu means, I already told, even a dust particle from Golok Vrindavan is complete. Whereas we are not complete, or everything incomplete in this material world. So as and when we can get in contact with this Purnavastu, then we can also feel satisfaction, not before that. The moment we can hear Arikata, understand everything, the moment we can realize that we are servant, we will have to serve Bhagavan. If we can realize, then all problem can come to an end, not before that. For so long, I was discussing about how Sanatana Goswami wanted to represent a comparative statement of Bhakti, so that we can realize. Most of us full of false ego, I am a devotee, I am great, who deserve for La puja patisha, everything is actually not bhakti. Prabhupada speaking, we want to engage the Supreme Lord in our seva. We don't like to serve Supreme Lord, we like to get seva from Supreme Lord. The moment we can get in touch with the Purnavastu, Purnavastu, the moment we can get in touch with that Purnavastu, then we can also feel satisfaction. But it's not so easy. We can get in connection with Purnavastu by the help of Sadguru, who can give us full service, Seva. We can go on doing Seva. Through Seva, we can get in connection with that Purnavastu. Then gradually, we can feel satisfaction. You can remember how Sankar Bhagavan going to express humble attitude when 
when actually Naraji Maharaj is going to glorify Rudra Bhagavan, Shankar Bhagavan become, you know, feeling upset. He say, no, no, don't speak that way. You are speaking, I am the Kipa Patra of Jagadishwar Krishna. No, not at all. Actually, I am asking the Kipa of the servant of the servant of Guru Vish, uh, of Bhagavan. I think I am also not, you know, fit to beg for this kind of kipa from them. I am not. That, that kind of power I don't have. I think I am not qualified to beg for kipa from Vaishnav Dasa Nuda, I mean Guru Vaishnav. Those who are the mm, eternal person of Bhagavan, Guru Vaishnav. Bhagavad Das, I, that much, you know, that much capacity I don't have, I, I have no quality. Even to ask for Kipa from them. So now you are going to speak them, Kipa Patta, this, that. So now, when Sankar Bhagavan is going to speak, Sambhranta Atho Munir Hitva Krishna, Krishna naikena tatsutim saparadha mivatmanam mannamano avabrichanai. Parikhid Mara speaking, the Sankar Bhagavan, after hearing this kind of you know, self glorification, after hearing this kind of self glorification, you know, Bhagavan, you know, Sri Krishna and Sri, you know, when hearing this that Naraji Maharaj is going to glorify Him, you know, non-different from Krishna. He is going to glorify this way, so that the Stava going to mean that Sankar Bhagavan Mahadev Sivji Maharaj is non different from Krishna. This way, when glorifying, then Sankar Bhagavan could not, could not, you know, keep patience. Immediately he get up, and just like he is thinking himself as a big, you know, aparadhi. As if Sankar Bhagavan thinking himself, I am Aparadhi, I am a great offender. So with this mood, gradually speaking to Naraji Maharaj. Hey, uh, sorry, actually, you know, gradually actually, Svarikhid Maharaj speaking, Mahadev, after hearing this kind of thing, Sunia, when Mahadev going to stop him speaking that way, then see Naraji Maharaj think himself that as if I am a great aparad, I have some done some mistake. Yeah. So while glorifying, Naraji Maharaj going to glorify, then suddenly when some reaction you if discover inside the heart of you know Sankar Bhagavan, then going to stop. Like an offender, you know, and very, very slowly going to speak something to in support of his sloka, stava, in support of his glorification. Naraji Maharaj now think himself that I am an offender because why Sankar become, you know, Mahadev become feeling disturbance. So gradually going to, you know, stop and, you know, now going to, you know, he was glorifying Sankar Bhagavan non-different with a mood to show non-different from Krishna. After this kind of protest, I mean, Sankar Bhagavan going to make him stop, then Naraji Maharaj speaking, really it is, really it is inconceivable. We cannot understand the mood of Guru Vaishnava. Sattameva Bhavan 
Vishnu Vaishnavanam Durgamam Nigudam Srenim Bhakti Vigyapai Tyopi What kind of glorification I can do? Really I am a, you know, I am foolish. I am going to speak that way. Actually, you are right. Actually, Guru Vaishnava, like you, Naraji Malayika, it is true that you, great Vaishnava, you know, can glorify Vishnu and Vaishnava Durgam Mahima Rasi. What kind of glorification I can speak? Nothing. But you actually can glorify Vishnu and Vaishnava, which is very secret thing. Usually Vaishnavas, their character, their behavior, their Siddhanta, common people cannot understand. That's why in Shastra we already know that Vaishnavir Kriya Mudra Bhigyena Bhujhaya. It is very Siddhanta. All the activities of Guru Vaishnava, even Bhigya, very knowledgeable person, they also cannot understand. Vaishnava Chinite Nare Devira Shakti. Even demigods, they cannot understand the mood of Vaishnava. So with this mood, Narajima speaking, well, you are right. Actually, Vishnu, Vaishnava, they are, you know, we cannot understand the depth of feeling. So what kind of glorification I can make? You can do, actually. You know, you actually can glorify Vishnu, Vaishnava, Duradigambo. I cannot do. It's impossible for us to do. Very, very depth. You know. So I cannot go reach up to that far. So you can actually. So very often we can see in Bhagavatam and in different Puran, different Sastra, you are glorifying Vishnu and Vaishnava. Many times we, we can see in Sastra. That is why you actually, you can understand, you know, the depth of Guru Vaishnav there, you know, it is inconceivable for us to understand. Ato, that is why you are famous in Vaishnav society. Everybody like to seek your Kepa. Ato, he Vaishnava Sreshtvair Rishati Tadano Graha Krishnascha Mahimanam te Prito Bito Nute Adhikam Tato hi Vaishnava Sreshtvai. That's why all, you know, big, big Vaishnavas, they are always going to seek your Kipa. All the time. Because in Bhagavatam we know Vaishnavanam Jathasam, Nimnagaram Jatha Ganga, Devanam Chutu Jatha, Vaishnavanam Jatha Sambhu, Puranam Tvita Bhagavatam. And also from Sastra, I already told. Vaishnav, Chinite, Nare, Devara, Shakti, even demigods, they cannot understand. Guru Vaishnav, so heavy, you know. Vaishnavir, Kriyamodda, Bhigyana, Bhujaya, so many warning given in Shastra. So, you know, so big, big Vaishnavas, they are always seeking for your Kipa. Or oh, what to speak more, Krishna always going to glorify you, some or other way. Krishna always satisfy with you, always satisfy with you, and always going to glorify you, different way. Somehow, Sankar Bhagavan always going to glorify you, all the time, different way. And we know from scriptural evidence that koti varangsya kishnena bara bibidho murti bhi bhaktya bhavantam aradho grihitaha koti shantina. We know from Shastra, scriptural evidence, that Krishna, time to time in different form, you know, wanted to worship you, wanted to do your bhajan and wanted to get kripa from you. Many times we know it. Chaitanya Mahaprabhu going there in Varanasi every day going to give water. 
on the head of Sankar Bhagavan, going to pray, you know, Ganga water speak. Every day, it's one God teaching for us. Also, Rameshwaram, they are also, Ramchandra going to worship, Krishna also time to time, you know, worshipping. This way, all the time we find, Krishna Bhagavan going to glorify you, your name, all the time. And Kuti Varang Sukhishne no Bara Vividha Murti Bhi, in different forms, Krishna wanted to do your worship and bhajan and wanted to get Kripa from you. That is, you know, we know from Sastra. Sri Krishna, with different form, you know, with, you know, with devotional mood, wanted to do your bhajan and time to time we wanted to get Kripa from you. We have seen, it is written in Sastra, Kati Varang Sri Krishna no Bara Vivida Murti Bhi Bhaktya Bhavantam Aradhu Grihi Taha Kutis Santi No. Then Parikhid Maharaj speaking to Mother, after hearing this kind of, for long time, for long time Naraji Maharaj glorifying Sankar Bhagavan, I mean Sivji Maharaj, but now it is extreme. He cannot bear. Parikhidma speaking, Iti Shrutva tu Sahasa Dhajyam Kartum Asakanuvan Asakanuvan Lajito Drutum Uthvayo Narada Samukham Haraha Karabhyam Pidadhe Dhrashtam Mamatanna Bade Riti Don't speak that way. Don't speak. Parikhidma speaking, Iti Shrutva. This way, after hearing this kind of glorification, self glorification, to Kintu, suddenly, Sahasa, he couldn't keep patience. Sahasa, Dhajyam, Kartum, Asakunubanam. Asakum, asakum, he couldn't keep patience. He was very shy. Suddenly, all on a sudden, he get up and going to run to Narad, want to reach Narad, the spot where Narad is sitting, and going to stop his mouth with karabhyam, with two, you know, plum hand. Want to stop. Don't speak that way. No. Wanted to stop Narad, wanted to stop Nara speaking that way. And speaking, don't try to, don't try to expose my audacity. This way you are going to, you know, going to express my audacity. Eh? Don't speak that, that way. Amadrishtata. Don't try to express in front of the public. It's very, you know, I am very, you know, shy. I cannot bear you are hearing that way. Anantaram Ubacho Chai, after they are speaking softly, you know, speaking you know, with loud voice, Ana, eh? Anantaram Ubacho Chai, Savismayo Maho Mune Durbi Tarko Taram Lila Vaibhavam Drishatam Prabhu, and started speaking loudly, E Muni. My, my Prabhu, Krishna, Bhagavan, Vishnu, His Leela, His activity, beyond, you know, comprehension. Durbitarko. Leela Vaibhav. You see, the Leela Vaibhav, you see the mood of Bhagavan, eh? He is going to do astuity and penance, is going to take, you know, Boon from me. You see. Eh? My Prabhu, he is, uh, you know, Parat Parakileshwar, Iswaraha, Paramakrishna, Satchidananda, Vigra, Anadi, Radhi, Govinda, Sarva, Karana, Karanam, or any Vishnu Tattva is coming from Krishna. Okay. You see the Leela of Bhagavan, Leela Vaibhav. Eh? At all people, at all people can believe. Is going to do astuity and finances to take benediction from me, boon from me. You see, 
Eh? You are speaking that way. Anantaram ubacho chai uchai sabis maho maho mune durbi tarkataram lila vaibhavam drishyatam pravaha. You see the excellence of the lila Bhagavan who can you know, find solution of that you know, question you are going to put in front of me. Aho vichitra gambhira mahimadhir madishwaraha. My Prabhu, my Master, my Prabhu is Mahima glorification. And, you know, is so, you know, you know, so heavy, so secret, full of significant that external people cannot understand. It is like, you know, 20,000 leagues under the sea. It's like the depth is like that. Who can understand? From outside, because people can watch only, you know, wave. But 20,000 leagues under the sea, material world, I am using. But the depth of Krishna Leela is impossible for us to understand. Why Bhagavan, what thing, why, when, doing, we cannot understand. Aho! Aho! Vichitra Gambhira Mahimadhir Madishwara. Vivideshu, Aparadheshu, Napikshato, Kriteshopi. I have done, I have done countless Aparad. Narad, I have done countless Aparad unto, unto the lotus feet of Bhagavan. And I have done countless Aparad. But still, he is not going to ignore me. That's a strange. That's a strange. I have done so many Aparad. One by one, why, if I can seek, speak to you, you cannot count. But still, it is the highness of Bhagavan, it is the glory of Bhagavan. He never wanted to ignore me. That is His Excellency, not mine. Aho vichitta gambhira mahimadhir madiswara vivideshu aparadheshu napikshata kriteshu opi. Then actually Parikhid Maharaj speaking now. Now Parikhid Maharaj speaking. Paramanandito dhritva padayor urupo veshatam naradaha paritushtavo krishna bhakti rasaplutam. Parikhid Maharaj speaking that. You know, Parikhidma speaking that Naraji Maharaj, after watching and you know, witnessing this kind of you know, Bhakti Rasa inside the heart of Siva, Sivji Maharaj, he was very, very happy. Paramanandita. After hearing this kind of humble attitude and this kind of remark, yes, you know, it's full of Bhakti Rasa. See, Narad, Bhakti Rasa. Apluto Siva, Sankar, Sankar Bhagavan is full of, you know, overflowing Krishna Bhakti Rasa Apluto. After hearing this kind of remark from Sankar, Naraji Maharaj, after hearing, approaching the lotus feet of Sankar and forcefully going to catch the lotus feet of Sankar, Pada Jugal, and, you know, going to help him to sit in asan. Now, Sankar Bhagavan get up from asan and running to Naraji Maharaj to, to, to stop speaking that way by the help of his you know, hand. Now, Naraji Maharaj is going to catch the lotus feet and requesting you and gradually and going to, going to help Sivji Maharaj, Sankar Bhagavan sit in his own asan again by requesting you, he is going to catch the lotus feet of Sankar in his chest, you know. And now going to glorify again. You know, this way, Parikhid Maharaj Vaso, Paramanandita Dhritva, Padayor, Rupa Veshatam, Naradaha, 
परितुष्टाबो कृष्ण भक्ति रसप्लता हा ग्रेजुअली ही इज गोइंग टू मेक संकर भगवान सिट इन इज आसन ही वाज एक्साइटेड टू इज गोइंग संकर भगवान गोइंग टू लूज इज पेशेंसी बाय हेयरिंग सेल्फ 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 ग्लोरिफिकेशन वो ये नेवर लाइक टू हियर सो नाउ नारद जी महाराज स्पीकिंग वट एवर यू आर सेंग Naraji Maharaj speaking. I know you are speaking. So you are giving so many. You know you are going to stop me speaking that way. But still, I am bound to speak. You are, you are the you know topmost devotee of Krishna. Krishna loves you so much. You are claiming you are going to speak that you have done countless aparad, and it is the highness of Krishna that is going not going to you know never mind. But actually, the point is that you are so near and dear one. You are a great devotee of Krishna. That's why there cannot be any scope on your part to do any aparad. Whatever you are doing, Krishna is satisfied. Follow what I say. So, if the activity is, if if your activity is going to satisfy Krishna, then it is not a real aparad. Like I can give the I can give example, you know, in Brajadam Brindavan, when Devaraj Indra, you know, discovered that he, you know Brajavasis they are not going to do any worship, his worship, then he was angry. He wanted to make some problem. Torrential rain, you know, flood, so many things happened. But after that, Indra Bhagwan, you know, wanted to beg for pardon. You know, doing, uh, you know, he started making abhishek of Krishna this way. But there was no stava. He is doing some stava prayer to Krishna. But you can find that prayer is not too long. It's not, you know. As though it's precise, but it's not still. I can say it's not big. Not. But when Brahma is going to make stava, Brahma also making abra. When going to you know satisfy Krishna, and is going on, going on, going on doing stava. But Bhagwan not giving any response. But when. Indra Maharaj doing you know stava. It was not you know big stava, not not long stava. Shortly he was successful to satisfy Govinda because his Indra Maharaj is very clever. He was approaching with Surabhi Ma, Surabhi Devi, Surabhi Ma on you know Surabhi Devi going first and then Indra going backside like a big offender, you know. So after watching Surabhi Devi, Krishna naturally become happy. After watching Surabhi Devi, he is happy. And after that, Indra going to pray to Krishna, and that prayer prayer was not so, no too long, no not big. Why? Because though we know Indra Maharaj, you know. In the Maharaj was, you know, we out of all sigo wanted to make some problem for Pajibasis, but still he was he wanted to take some reprisal against Pajibasis, revenge. But still the situation created by his torrential rain and flood, everything was favorable to the desire of Krishna. Follow what I say. It was just anyway. It was just favorable to Krishna because all Brajavasis and Krishna also thinking those Brajavasis. They for long time they are thinking the when Supreme Lord can make such situation. Vidhata when can make this kind of situation when non-stop we can watch Krishna day and night when this kind of situation can come in our life because you know. अक्षन्नताम फलमिदम न परम विदामो बेनुगिता, you know, the success of our eyes is to watch the lotus feet of Krishna. 
Akshanatam Palamidam Naparam Midam Itadi Sloka there Venigita. Now point is there. Though Naraji and actually though actually Indra Maharaj doing some aparat, his activities was you know not good, but still it was in favor of the desire of Bajavasis and Krishna. They want to they were they for long time they are searching for long time they are searching such a scope opportunity when they can see Krishna all the time day and night because Krishna is very chanchal restless you know sometimes going to Goshala sometimes going to you know take prasadam going to forest here and forest even which you know this forest that forest where Krishna is staying there is no stability no surety. Bichikyura, those gopis, you know, they are searching Krishna from one forest to another forest. Bichikyura, unmattakabad banat banam, like mad, they are searching Krishna. In search of Krishna, they are going here and there, all throughout the, you know, Brajimandal. So now Krishna is chancha. So, when Devaraj Indra wanted to make such a situation in which Brajavasis can feel problem, they can understand. This is the punishment for, you know, for, you know, stopping his archan, puja. Now actually, we find all the activities of Indra Maharaj was favorable for Krishna. So Radharani, all Gopikas, all, you know, Nanda Yasoda, all, you know, Brajavasis, senior devotees, Brajavasis, all they could get the chance to see Krishna all the time, seven days, day and night, non-stop rain was there. So, they are looking at Krishna. That's why Krishna was not so, you know. But when Pitama Brahma wanted to make, you know, make him satisfy, that time, Pitama being a Brahma making stop, long stop. Because Pitama, Pitama, Pitama Brahma wanted to make, give pain to Krishna. A feeling of separation, want to give. He wanted to abduct all coward boys and cows. Krishna was, you know, separated from them for a long time, one year. And within one year, Krishna took the form of all as it is. All you know, you know, covered boys and cows, all. Follow this way. That's why we can remember the sloka by and uh, sometimes Prabhupada used to say Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami Prabhupada Aradhito Yadi Tapasas Aradhito Yadi Hari Tapasas Tataskim Naradhito Yadi Hari Tapasas Tataskim Antar Bahir Yadi Harihi Tapasas Tataskim Nantar Bahir Yadi Harihi Tapasas Tataskim If Krishna is satisfied with my activities, what I can do? If Krishna, I know. If Krishna is not satisfied with me, then what is my seva is useless. This way argument. Now, I wanted to, you know, you know speak this point. Because, because Parikhit Maharaj, you know, speaking, you know, Naraji Maharaj speaking, Parikhit Maharaj speaking, that Naraji Maharaj going to help Shankar Bhagavan to sit his own asan by catching the lotus feet. After that, Naraji Maharaj Vacha, that you have done no opera, whatever you are doing, a some or other way, it is one kind of, you know, you know, Lila Pushti is going to help Krishna Lila. You are going to help Krishna Lila, decorate Krishna Lila, when to do all your activities. Say, Narada Vacho, Napo Radhava Kasaste, Prayasaha Kaschit Achyute. You are a great devotee of Krishna, there cannot be any aparat. You cannot make any aparad unto a lotus feet of Krishna. Kadachit loko drishtapi jato nasmin prakasati. Outside people can 
outside people surely can pass this kind of rima that mahadev has done aparad unto lotus feet of sang and uh, lotus feet of krishna so naraji ma speaking external people who they have you know they don't know they have no knowledge that's why they can think that you have done some aparad unto lotus feet of krishna but truly speaking krishna never want to count krishna never want to count any your aparad any of your aparad you know napo napo radha napo radha va kasaste napo radha va kasaste preyasah kashit achute kadachit loko drishtapi yato nasmin prakasate krishna not going to count any aparad your aparad always happy you know now naraji ma speaking you can remember one or two case naraji ma is going to speak naraji ma is speaking sabahu baladiptasya sadhu upadrava karinah maya baddha niruddh अनिरुद्धस्य युद्ध मानस चक्रेणा हत प्रायस बानस निज भक्त पुत्र बध पालित पालित तया प्राण रक्षाथम से हरि स्तुत शब्द हिवा रूसम प्रीत दत्या निज स्वूपतम भवत्पर्षदता निन्ने तम दुरापम सुरैरूपी what naraji mara speaking naraji is speaking we can remember the case of your fighting with krishna eh because you 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 love your disciple because you love your disciple banasur big you love him very much you know you love banasur and balasur you know he was expressing too much you know false ego he was making so much problem for guru vishnu everything so bahu or he was you know you know hundreds of hands banasur so bahu baladiptasya sadhu gut sadhu upadrava karina banasur always making problem against guru vishnu so स बाहू बल दीप्त साधु पद्मकारिण एंड ऑल्सो यू कैन रिमेम्बर वी कैन रिमेम्बर दैट सम हाउ अनिरुद्ध वॉज टेकन बाई उषा 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 इन अ रूम उषा इज अ डॉटर ऑफ मनासुर सो सम हाउ इज अ लॉन्ग हिस्ट्री आई डोंट लाइक टू स्पीक सो मेनी थिंग्स नो टाइम सम हाउ Anirudha was taken here into the room of you know Usha. Actually, purposely Anirudha not coming from Daruka straight away. It was you know he was you know taken by Yogva. Follow. So now actually, when you discover Anirudha with your daughter, you become angry with Anirudha, and you wanted to attack Anirudha. he wanted to make to captive he wanted to you know put him inside jail and uh, wind him so so bahu baladiptasya sadhu buddha bakarina maya badhya aniruddhasya yuddha manasya chakrena when you put anirudha into your you know kastode in that case krishna was informed so there was a there there is a there was a big fighting took place maya abaddha niruddha sajuddha manas chakrena chakrena min chakradhari and when banasur was giving fitting answer by krishna do bhagwan bhagwan know it very well that you love banasur as your son so anyway no but still punishment is a must otherwise is too much excess you know so banasur was given fitting answer by krishna 
Krishna, by the help of chakra, will, wanted to cut all his hands. And he was so, you know, pop, you know, so false ego. Someday he is going to speak to Gurudev, Sankar, Bhagavan. Actually, I find nobody, I find nobody with whom, I find nobody with whom I can fight something. I find you are suitable. Ah? Huh? Then Sankar Bhagavan was very angry. You like to fight with me? Foolish? Okay. You can get satisfaction someday. Eh? So, you know, false ego, we have to speak past remark. Actually, I find nobody who can fight with me. Only you are the, you know, matching, you know. <laughs> so, Sankar Bhagavan is very angry. This way, anyway, now, Banasur was giving fitting answer. Bhagavan Sri Krishna, by the help of chakra, wheel, wanted to cut all hands. But now, in the meantime, Sankar Bhagavan was feeling disturbance, he was feeling, you know, anxiety. He wanted, he started requesting to Krishna Prabhu, anyway, you please stop, you don't kill that Asura, he is my, you know, like my son, you know, I have given you assurance to protect, so you will have to keep my promise actually, protect my promise, anyway, so then, by the stava of Krishna, by the stava of Sankar Bhagavan, Krishna Bhagavan was bound to stop. Krishna told that anyway, in the heritage of Prahlad Maharaj, I am not going to kill anybody. It is my assurance. I can, I can, I can never kill. So, don't worry. Now, point is that to, to, is uh, too much, you know, false ego, so to cut his false ego, to cut his false ego, I am bound to cut all his hands, I can keep only four. Only four mean, it is externally we see, four hand mean, like Naran, Bhagavan Sri Krishna sometimes used to maintain four hands, most, most of the time, but in Vrindavan only is two hands, two hands. So here it is written, the Bhagavan Sri Krishna wanted to make him Parshad of Sankar. And wanted to give him some appliances, such a dignity, which is rare for other people to get. Nobody can get. So it is written, Saddo Hitva Rusam, when you started praying to Krishna Prabhu, I give him assurance I can produce. So you please, you know, stop, you don't kill. Saddha Hitva, when you do stava prayer, immediately Bhagavan going to, you know, you know, going to express his, you know, happy mood. Hitva Rusham Prito, you are satisfied with you. And he wanted to give Bhavat Parshadatam, he wanted to make you, make Banasuri your Parshad. And he left him with Four hands. Four hands mean Bhagavan usually having some, you know, four hands, na, Sankha Chakra Gata. So here, and you have to give honor, it is written. He was giving, you know, Asurke Nijo Sarupo. Sarupo, you have four hands. So you are also going to grant four hands to him this way. Actually, this Sarupo doesn't mean which we usually understand. Sarupo means anybody going to give Sarupo Mukti who is going to give the same, same thing as Bhagavan. Sarupa, Sarupa, same. Four, not only that four hands, all the, you know, body, everything, all like Narayan. Only Kostuba money is not there. Sivasa, Chinna, the symptom of Sivasa, Lanchan, you know, you don't know. You cannot remember. Brigamuni wanted to provide a kick on the chest of Naran. You can remember that that you know Bhagavan going to give this in a permanent you know impression. It's like printed thing on the chest. It's called Siva Sachinna. And Kostubamani, it's all, all the special with Bhagavan. Ordinary people, ordinary, you know, Jiva Josua, those Jivatma, those who are going to attain Sarupamakti. Surely they cannot get Kostubamani. 
all other same. Follow what I say. Shaddo hitva rusham prito datya nijasarupatam bhavat parshadatam ninne tam durapam surai rupi. Even those demigods, they cannot give that kind of dignity what you are going to allow to him. So you know, you see. This way, Naraji Maharaj is going to speak. Napo Radha Vakashaste Priyasaha Kaschit Achute Kadachit Lok Dishtapi Yato Nasmin Prakasati. So Bahu Balad Diptasho Shadhu Bodrob Shadhu Bodrob Karinaha Maya Badhyanur Dasho Yudamanasa Chakrinaha Chakrina. Hatha prayasya banasya nijo bhaktasya putra bad lali tasya tvaya pranara kshartam si harihis tutaha. Then, shaddo hitva rusham prito datya nijo sarupatam bhavat parshatatam ninne tat duratam surairapi. This way, Naraji Maharaj is going to glorify again and again and going to speak more, is going to speak more. Vaishnav Drohi, Narajima speaking more. Bhavangsha Vaishnava Drohi, Gargadi Bhyo, Shudus Charai, Tapo Vir Bhajo, Mane Bhyo, Nabalikam Baram Dhati. You are very clever, you know. Actually, those who are going to do aesthetic and finances, you know, to get your boon, you are very clever. You are not going to give them flawless boon. They are asking their asura. They cannot see future, past, future, present. They cannot see. They are, you know, full of, you know, karma. So you are very clever. You are going to fulfill their desire, but with some hole. <laughs> so that, uh, so that in future treatment can be done. <laughs> so you are very clever. Babangsho Vaishnava Drohi Garga Adi Bhyo Sudus Charai Tapo Vir Bhajo Mane Bhyo Nabbali Kam Baram Dhati. Vaishnava Drohi Garga Tanoy, I mean the son of Garga and etc. They are doing dushchara, impossible this kind of Australian finances. But they have drawn. Follow. And after that, they wanted to get some boon from you, Kripa. It's not actually Kripa. <laughs> they want to, you know, get some fanciful boon. But you are very clever. Though they wanted to get some boon from you, but you never allowed them to get you know, boon, which is, you know, concrete boon, not that. Always you put some flaw, flawless boon, you know. So this way, so, Naraji Maharaj want to prove that actually, Naraji Maharaj always want to prove that all your activity Naraji Maharaj want to speak that actually all your external activity is going to prove that you are against Krishna. But we think always Krishna Lila, we find the Krishna Lila fully decorated with your Lila, positive or negative, whatever it may be, is going to give us a taste of Krishna Lila. So, anyway, follow. You are going to fulfill the heart of Krishna. Externally, somebody can see, okay, has done some mistake, you know. But not that actually. So, you can remember actually, those who are against Jadav and Pandav, those who are, you know, against Krishna and Jada, Panda, always they are fighting. Garga Tanai, Adi, etc. It means Jayadratha. You can remember, Jayadratha was doing 
strong student finances and after that when bhagwan shankar appear he wanted to get one boon what manage i like to kill arjun oh impossible i like to defeat arjun impossible you cannot do it it is not possible you know jayadrad sudakshina they wanted to attack darika dhami can remember all they wanted to do astrian finances they wanted to get you know benediction from you but you are very clever you never wanted to allow the, and uh, allow them with you know flawless benediction always you keep some hole always you keep some hole because this kind of demon they are not krishna bhakta they must get some treatment some day they can get some punishment that's why you are you know going to keep some loop soul gargatha nai going to you know make some problem with jadukul you know wanted to fight with jadu jadukul so you never get and jayadratha you know jayadratha wanted to get this kind of boon i like to kill krishna i i like to kill arjun i like to defeat panchabanda but shankar bhagwan speaking no is impossible you can conquer you can come out successful one time but all panchabanda except you know arjun when arjun is not there that time you can defeat one time you know this way all of them they are like asur they are making so much problem you know sudakshina ke eh ab brahman pojojito abicha you know this sudakshina wanted to make problem so many so that time also he wanted to give them a the him boon that was also not flawless this way भवांशा वैष्णव द्रोही गर्गादिभ्यो सुदुश्चर तपभिर्भजमानेभ्यो नाव्यलिखम बरम दधे अव्यलिक मने फ्लॉलेस नॉट यू आर नॉट क्यूंग टू गिव किपा ऑल्सो नारद जी मा स्पीकिंग वी कैन रिमेम्बर द केस ऑफ चित्र कैथु चित्र कैथु वॉन्टेड टू क्रिटिसाइज यू योर एक्टिविटीज यू कैन रिमेम्बर Chetakadu was going, you know, by his, you know, chariot, and when he discovers Shankar Bhagwan going to speak Hari Katha by keeping Devi, Bhagwati Devi, in the left, you know, thigh, and sitting in front of Rishi Mani to speak Hari Katha, that time Chitraketu Pravitayo Dhyo Opi. अंशाश्रिता हरे हे निंदका यद्यपि शो तेभ्यो है नक्कुपह तथा न चित्तकेतु एंड अदर सम नाइन टाइम टू टाइम सो मेनी यू नो चित्त लाइक चित्तकेतु सो मेनी पीपल गोइंग टू डि लाइक यू नो वी कैन रिमेम्बर द केस ऑफ यू नो दख सो मेनी केस सच so chittaketu when wanted to criticize you but you never wanted to express angry attitude as is paramansa happy you know shankar bhagwan not going to give response to anybody if they are going to insult him but shankar bhagwan going to give response when guru vaishnav bhagwan they are going to do some aparadh then bhagwan shankar bhagwan never asks so chitta gadu etc of the they when they you know criticize you but you never expressed your angry attitude because they are all you know tara they are harir angshavatar sankarsan astitu actually dakha is not sankarsan astitu i am speaking about chitta ketu 
Chittuketu and Sankar Bhagavan, both of them the God brothers, each other. They are giving, they are taking initiation from Sri Sankarshan Bhagavan. So, Harir Angshavatar Sri Sankarshan Asritu. That's why this kind of case also we can find in the case of Bhakti Vidya Madhav Goswami Maharaj. One devotee, he was in trouble. Madhav Goswami anyway wanted to help him, give shelter, all everything, all problem, disease, money spending, all so many things. After that, he is going to criticize. He is going to criticize Madhav Goswami. Madhav Goswami is giving to, going to give instruction to Bharti Maharaj, I mean Narottama Brahmachari, you must serve that, you know, my God brother. Bharti Maharaj speaking, he always criticizes you. How I, can, how I can serve? It is my instruction. You will have to serve him. I will be very happy if you do. It's impossible. One, one side, one side this guru, you know, one, in one side there is aparat. If I discuss with any man, any, you know, bhakta who is going to criticize my Gurudev, and another point, whereas my Gurudev giving instruction, my Guru Maharaj is going to give instruction to me, you will have to serve. At the same time, it is prohibited to see the mouth and see the face of anybody who is going to criticize my Guru. Which way I can go? Narthama Brahmacharya is writing one letter. Maharaj, how I can serve him? He is criticizing you. Guru Maharaj speaking, Madhavakushan says, it is my instruction. You will have to serve him. How I can serve? You will have to serve. I will become very happy. So, we, by the instruction of Gurudev, Madhav Goswami, he was bound to do seva. After that, he came to know the reason. What is the reason? By the, the actually, they are my God brother. He is my God brother. He has taken shelter of Prabhupada and, and very often he is speaking, we are the, we are the son of lion. Bhakti, you know, Siddhanta Saraswati Goswami, Prabhupada. We, eh, we are the son of lion. So I love this way. He, you know, anyway, he criticized me, no problem, you will have to serve. So you see, Shankar Bhagavan also with this mood. They had taken shelter, Chittagatu has taken shelter onto Lotus feet of Sankarshan, Sam Godwell. So he never mind. Anyway, uh, this kind of criticism. So you never mind. Chitra Ketu Prabhita Yo Adhiyo Opi Angshasrita Harehe Nindaka Yadapi Sasho Tebhyo Tebhyo Akupahasta Thapina. You never become angry with him. Though actually, maybe. Chitta Ketu, they are not knowing the full, your full glory, you know, what is your excellency, they, maybe they, do, they have no full information about that, they have done. This way, Naraji Maharaj, one by one, going to give example to them, to, for example, to Sankar Bhagavan, and after they are speaking, Krishna Sapritaye, Tasma Srishtam Opi Abhibanchata Tat Bhakta Taiva Chaturjo Visheshena Visheshena Arthitataya. Now, some point Naraji Maharaj is going to speak, which, of, which outside people cannot understand. Naraji Maharaj very clever. Naraji Maharaj is going to explain. Krishna so pritaye tasma chrishtam opi abhibanchata tat bhakta taiva chaturjo visheshena arthita taya. And 
Actually, some outside people can speak. Outside people can criticize you. That someday you are doing austerity and finances, doing bhajan of Krishna. You are asking for benediction. Which benediction? So that you can get more glory than Krishna. Someday, you started doing austerity and finances, bhajan of Krishna. Krishna appeared. You are asking benediction. What benediction? Oh Prabhu, you know, you are unique, I know. But I like to get more, you know, you know, I am my archan, my everything, every you know, those devotees they can feel more excellent. So I like to get this kind of benediction. My puja, my bhajan, my aradhana will be more than that. Follow. Externally, you can say it's very offensive. Externally, you cannot understand. You can think it is surely offensive. How I can say that Bhagavan, my glorification, you know, I like to I like to get more glorification than you. This is offensive. Eh? How this kind of benediction Krishna can give? But surely Krishna giving this benediction. Krishna is going to give benediction. Now somebody can, you know, point out that how it is possible that Shankar Bhagavan is, you know, is a, you know, keep a patra of Krishna, whereas he is going to, you know, ask benediction that way. So Naraji Maharaj is going to give answer. Actually, you are going to, you are going to beg for this kind of benediction. It is also in favor of Krishna. How? But Krishna always likes to glorify devotees. Eh? My Krishna speaking, my devotee, their worship, their glorification is more than me. Krishna himself speaking. Krishna always speaking, no? This way. Mat puja, eh, no. Mat bhakta puja abhyadikko is written. If somebody is going to worship me, not going to worship my devotee, I never like to take their worship. No, 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 no. Never. Bhagavan speaking. Aham bhakta paradhino hi asatantra ivadijo. How the glorification of Ambarish Maharaj was expressed in the world. How many times, you know, Bhagavan Sri Krishna wanted to glorify the name of Sankar. I already told by drinking the hala hal poison, Krishna allowed him to do many times. Follow. This way, actually, Krishna Sapritaye, Naraji Maharaj specifically going to speak. That is not ordinary benediction. You are very clever. He is speaking to Sankar. Actually, you wanted to beg for this kind of benediction. But it is also for the satisfaction of Krishna. You have no interest in it. Krishna Svapitaye Tashma Shrestam Opi Abhivanchata Tad Bhakta Taiva Chaturjo Visheshena Arthita Taya. You are very clever. Somebody can say outside people that you are asking this so you are very offender. Not that. Actually, keeping in mind, keeping in mind the mood of Krishna, you wanted to beg this kind of pardon. Actually, Krishna is very happy. I can, be, I, I can give another example. In Chaitanya Bhagavad Chaitanya, you can find that Nityananda always, you know, going to, you know, glorify the name of Gauranga. I am the servant of Gauranga. I am Sevak. Hello. In Krishna Lila you can find, in Gaur Lila also you can find somebody going to pay Dandavat to Gauranga Mahaprabhu in front of Nityananda. Mahaprabhu become very, very angry. Hey, you are paying Dandavat to me? You see here is, you know, Nityananda. So always Mahaprabhu wanted to show the respect of Nityananda, the glories of Nityananda is more than 
my glorification. Nityananda more. So, if somebody is going to pay Dandavat to Goranga Mahaprabhu in front of Nityananda, you, you rascal, foolish. You paying Dandavat to me. First of all, you should pay Dandavat to Nityananda. They say Mahaprabhu is going to you know, teach us. You can remember huh? in Jugal Git, in Bhagavad 10 Kanto, you can find how Krishna is going to glorify the lotus feet of Balaram. In Jugal Git. There is there. Also, we find sometime Krishna and Balaram traveling in this all this posturing field in, inside Vindavan forest with cows, sometime feeling tired, sometime feeling tired. So Balaram when going to take rest, Krishna going to message the lotus feet of Balaji Maharaj. Krishna is going to message the lotus feet of Balaji Maharaj. Follow what I say. Now you can put question, why Balaji Maharaj taking? Where Balaji Maharaj know he is my, he is my Prabhu? You can say, why Balaji Maharaj is going to take service from Krishna? Eh? You can put this question. So, Balaji Maharaj actually number one seva. You know, Ananta Dev. He is serving Krishna in all countless way. Now, Balaji Maharaj is going to take service from Krishna. Actually, in Shastra, you know, the you know, commentator, you can understand their mood. Actually, Balaji Maharaj taking the service from Krishna to give satisfaction to Krishna. What you say? Yes. Balaji Maharaj never want to take any service from Krishna. But taking Krishna, seva from Krishna to give satisfaction to Krishna. So what do you mean by seva? What do you mean by seva? Is Bala, if Balaji Maharaj, you know, if Krishna if Krishna is going to give message to Balaji Maharaj, still it is the service of Krishna. Because Krishna is feeling satisfaction. Follow. When Radharani, when Radharani is speaking, to Krishna, you know, Radharani going to speak to Krishna, you get out from here. And speaking to Lalita, don't allow him to come. So you can understand the you cannot understand the Seva Mutra of Radharani. Radharani crying, Radharani crying. Why? She could not get the scope to serve Krishna. That is why. All his chiding has some great significance. Radharani is going to charge Krishna very heavily, but with a mood to serve. That is why Krishna is speaking in Chaitanya Shirtamita, Priya Jodi Man Kori Kore Vasan Vedastuti Hoityo Hare Man Man. That's why Krishna writing in Chaitanya Shirtamita, if my Priya, Radharani, Lolita, Visaka, Adi, they are speaking heavily to me. Very heavy. They charge me. Still, I feel very happy if somebody is going to, you know, worship me, glorify me with Vedic hymns. Oh, Namo Bhagavati Vasudevaya. But I am not satisfied. If Radharani is speaking, get out from here. I become very happy. <laughs> if Lalita is speaking, how dare you do this? I become very happy. So, Ch Krishna Bhagavan writing in Chaitanya Charitamita, Priya Jodi Man Kuri Kare Vasan Vedastuti Haito Hare Man is more than Vedastuti. I don't care Vedastuti. Of course I care, but with this, you know, not Raganuga Bhakta Dosa. But when I hear that my, you know, Sakhi Manjari they are speaking heavily, so I become very happy. I like to hear. I like to hear that kind of, you know, you know. So this way we find Krishna Sapitoye Tasmat Shrestam Opi Abhivanchata Tat Bhakta Taiva Chaturja Visheshena Arthita Taya. You are very clever. You know the heart of Krishna. You know the heart of Krishna. That's why we wanted to, you know, big, you know, that kind of boon. Because you know Krishna is going to glorify. 
Krishna always going to glorify devotees. So you know the heart of Krishna. That's why indirectly you wanted to satisfy. Indirectly you wanted to satisfy Krishna. You have no self-interest. Follow. Many times in Bhagavata we find so many sloka. Aho bato sapacho ato gariyan jo jivbhagre bartate nama to bhyam te pus tapas te yuhu susnu rarya brahman uchur nama grananti jete. Banni surjo brahman ebhyo te jiyan vaishtava sada na vicharo na bhogascha vaishnava anam sakarma anam. Viprat disaraguna jutat aravinda nabo padaravinda vimukhat sapachambaristam manne tadarpito mano vache mano vachane ahitartho pranam punati sakulam natu vudimanaha. Follow? So many. Follow? So many things we can find. Janasya Krishnat vimukasya daivad Adharma silasya sudhukkitasya anugrahaye acharanti nunam bhutani bhavvani yanat. You know, always Bhagavan is going to glorify devotees. Brahmananam sahasrebhyo shatra yaji vishishvate shatra yaji sahasrebhyo sarva vedanta paragaha sarva vedanta vitkacya vishnu bhakto vishishvate vishnavanam sahasrebhyo ekanteko vishishvate. Follow. So many, always Bhagavan going to glorify. Always Bhagavan going to glorify. Sadhu. Aham bhakta paradhino hi asadantra hivadijo sadhu vir sadhu vir grasto hirdayo bhakta ir bhakta janapriya sadhu hidayam madjam sadhu nam hridayantu aham madanatte na yananti na aham te bhyo manakavi. Bhavat Vidha Bhagavataha Tirthi Bhuta Swayam Prabhu Tirthi Kurvanti Tirthani Santa Stena Gada Vritaha. Anyway, all the time, you know, all the time going to glorify Vaishnava. All the time. Bhagavan going to glorify. All the time. Bhagavan going to glorify Guru Vaishnava. So that's why. Archaya meva hare ya pujam sraddhaya hate nata bhakti su chanesu sa bhakta prakita sita. Those who are not going to worship Bhagavan, eh, they are going to worship Bhagavan, not going to worship devotee. They are actually, Bhagavan don't care his puja. Bhagavan don't care his puja. Who is going to ignore Guru Vaishnava, going to insult Guru Vaishnava, and going to worship chant Harina? Never Bhagavan. Never go on like that. This way, Bhagavan always likes to glorify. Many times speaking, the worship of my devotee is more than my worship. Devotee, eh? those who are going to worship me and not my devotee, I I am less interested to take their, you know, worship. I don't care. Follow. This way, countless so we can speak, where we can find Bhagavan always like to glorify. Mahat vichalanam nirnam gihinam dina chetasam nisasayo Bhagavan nanyatha kalpate kachit. Follow. Mahantir, you know, four many sloka we can find. Hmm. Nami, Nami, Abhakta Chatur Vedi, Madhbhakta Sapacha Priya, Tasmai Deyo Tato Grahyam, Sacha Pujyo Jathahi Aham. Bhagavan speaking, Chatur Vedi, he is no, I have knowledge about Chatur, four Vedas, Chauve, he is Brahman. Still, if he is not devotee, you know, Brahman Haile Javak, you know, not that. He is Brahman, he is knowing four breath, recite, he is, you know, 
No, 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 that is not the syndrome of my devotee. If my devotee can take birth in chandal, very low caste, those who are burning lass in crematorian ground, it's called chandal. Tirupan allar, you know, Ranganatham Tirupan allar. He, has a, he took birth in a very, very low caste chandal, but still Ranganatham wanted to prove his glory. So you see, Sotokopa, so many examples I can give. Sotokop, he took birth very low caste. Tirupan Allah in South India. So low caste. Ramanuja speaking, is my Gurudev, Sotokop. I glorify him. Not that he has taken birth in a low family. Not that. That's why in Chaitanya Chaitanya we know. Nichu yati nahi Krishna bhajane jogo. Nichu yati nahi Krishna bhajane ajogo. Yes, Haridas Thakur has taken birth in a low caste. You know, Muslim family, not that. He is, you know, he cannot do my bhajan. And who has taken birth in Satkul Brahman, high age, not that he can do my bhajan. It is not the your stick, no standard. Who is doing bhajan? Is you know, Jai Baja Sevaru Abhakta Himthar. So, this way, Bhagavan speaking, <coughs> if some Brahman who is having knowledge in four Vedas going to worship me, but still he is not my devotee. <coughs> and if my devotee taking birth in a very low caste like Chandal, still he is a great, you should worship him more than me. You should worship him all, all, you should worship him more than me. Follow this way. <coughs> this way Bhagavan glory always want to glorify Guru Vaishnav. And you know it very well. To satisfy Bhagavan Sri Krishna, you are asking for that kind of benediction. We are very you are very clever. Krishna so prithaye tasma shrestam opi avivanchata tat bhakta toivo chaturjo visheshena arthita toya. Outside people can misunderstand you, but we know, we know your glory, so nobody can, you know, make fool of us. Ah, now, now actually Naraji. Speaking and speaking, Tato Brahmadir Sangpatho Mukti Danadhi Karitam Bhavate Bhavatoi Cha Durgoi Durgavai Bhagavan Adat. What it means? Tato, you are very dear to Krishna. Krishna loves you very much. That is why Tato. Brahmadi Sangpartho. This kind of Mukti Dan. Nobody have a right to give Mukti. Brahma cannot give. All demigods they cannot give. Mukti. Mukti Data Vishnu Deva Nasangsayu. It is written in Sastra. Jiva Goswami Bhagavad writing in Sandarbha. Mukti nobody can give. Mukti Data Vishnu Deva Nasangsayu. But here, Naraji Maharaj is going to speak, glorify Sankar Bhagavan that this kind of Brahmadi, Brahma, also, you know, you know, Brahma can, you know, pray to Bhagavan so that can give, so that can get the power power to give somebody mukta, moksha. Brahma also cannot give. That kind of power is not there in Brahma. But Sankar is given. That's why Narajima is speaking, how you can speak, you know, we know your glories. Tato Brahma Adi Sankpartho, what Brahma, Brahma can pray to get that kind of power, but that kind of power not given to Brahma, given to you. Tato 
ब्रह्मादि संपार्थो मुक्ति दानाधिकारी ना कारितम मुक्ति मोक्षो who can give you can give भवते 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 मैंने it is honourable word भवते and भवत्ते चार दुर्गावे also you and your wife I mean शक्ति दुर्गा both of them भगवान keep reserve the right for you or you too so that you can give mukti to anybody if you like follow tato brahmadi sampartho mukti dana adhikaritam bhavate bhavatvai cha durgavai bhagavan adat that is why you are very dear to krishna krishna love you very much that's why krishna going to give you right power to give mukti to anybody and also not only you your wife also bhagavati also going to get this kind of durge this kind of moksha if you like to give to somebody you can give but that kind of power is not there with you know brahma so you see so bhagwan is controlled by pure devotees and from shastra we know many time in chaitanya 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 bhag where not where not everywhere where not krishna bhakti janma mul hoy sadhu sang the very root cause of krishna bhakti is sadhu sang glorification of sadhu sadhu sang sadhu sang sarva shastre koy lab matra sadhu sange सर्वसिद्धि है एक्चुअली भगवान इज भक्त भक्ति मान यू डोंट नो ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड भगवान इज ऑल्सो भक्त भक्त ऑफ होम डिवोट इज वी नो सिद्धांत भगवान इज भक्त भक्ति मान भगवान ऑलवेज लाइक टू सर्व डिवोटी always follow only in vrindavan dham na pare aham nirabadh sanjujam jama abajano durjano geo singkhala sangvishya tadva pratiyat sadhuna only in sai vrindavan but all devotee you know all the devotee, wherever you find pure devotees they are also not going to ask anything But Bhagwan will also like to give something because bhakti is there. If Krishna bhakti is there, which is impossible for him. If at all Krishna bhakti, pure Krishna bhakti is there inside the heart of one devotee, what is impossible for him? Everything is possible. Kim kim alabhya tayi prasanne, kim alabhya tayi prasanne. Hey Bhagwan. if you are satisfied with devotee what they cannot get all what is you know impossible even without asking bhagwan giving so bhagwan always like to pay you so bhagwan is also like to serve you though we cannot think that way but in siddhanta we like to serve bhagwan but bhagwan at the same time like to serve pure devotees भगवान ऑल्सो भक्त भक्ति मान यू हैव योर भक्ति यू हैव योर भक्ति एट ऑल इफ यू हैव योर भक्ति फॉर भगवान यू कैन सर्व एंड भगवान हैज भक्ति फॉर डिवोटिस फॉलो वर इज एट ऑल इफ यू हैव भक्ति फॉर भगवान यू कैन गिव सर्विस टू भगवान एंड भगवान इज ऑल्सो हैविंग भक्ति दैट्स वाई भगवान लाइक टू सर्व डिवोटिस भगवान इज ऑल्सो भक्ति मान भगवान इज ऑल्सो भक्ति मान भक्त भक्ति मान भगवान इज भक्त भक्ति मान सो दिस इज अ सिद्धांत सो फ्रॉम स्टार्टिंग टू एंड ऑल शास्त्र वी कैन गेट द ग्लोरिफिकेशन ऑफ शास्त्र एवरीथिंग ब्रह्मांड भ्रमित को भाग्यवान जीव गुरु गुरु कृष्ण प्रसाद पाए भक्ति लता बीज ऑल द वे ऑल द ग्लोरिफिकेशन ऑफ भक्त इवन अबाउट उद्धव जी महाराज भगवान स्वीकिंग Hmm. Hmm. Huh? 
न उद्धव अनुपी मनु नो डोंट थिंक उद्धव इज लेस देन मी नॉट इवन है नो पॉइंट जीरो 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 वन नो परसेंट नो उद्धव इज आइडेंटिकल आइडेंटिकल विथ मी है नो अनुपी मनु नो नो अनुपी मनु नो उद्धव उद्धव इज नॉट एट ऑल लेस देन मी Bhagwan going to give this, I uh, know, this chair. Go glorify all the time. Bhagwan glorifying. This way all the time, Bhagwan like to glorify devotees and devotees like. This way, I uh, know, Naraji Maharaj speaking. Bhagwan Sri Krishna love you so much, respect you so much. He is going to give you right, you know, to give, you know, you have your right to give moksha. Mukti, you and your wife, I mean Durga, Bhagavati Devi, both of you can give mukti. Te. But one point I like to clarify: it is hundred percent perfect. The Siddhanta not wrong, but here one Siddhanta you should here understand that Bharan, but that Shankar Bhagwan can give mukti, but that mukti is not direct mukti, gradual mukti. So in this respect, I like to speak some point. Like in Shastra, you can find, see Puran here, there, you know, and on different place you can find in Puran. There is written different Baraha Puran. Also, I can quote from different place. Kasi Maranath Mukti. It is confirmed. It is confirmed that if somebody going to die in Varanasi. Surely he can get mukti, but in you know, Baraha Puran also there is written Baraha Puran or what Puran I forget, but a slok I remember, I memorize in station, in you know, Sukar Khetra. It is written, Gaya Yan Chas Tale Mukti, Gaya Dham, Gaya Dham you know, Lord Sri Da Vishnu, Mahaprabhu went to Gaya na. It is written about the mukti prakaran. I like to discuss and stop today. Tomorrow I can discuss again, and you know follow. It is written in sastra, gaya yancha stale mukti, bara na sham jale stale, eh, jale stale cha antarikshe tridha mukti cha sukare. What do you mean? It is written if somebody going to die in. You know, Gaya Khetro in land can get mukti. Gaya into Gaya into stale mukti. Baranasan in Baranasi, jal water and land. And in Shukar Khetro, water, land, and in space anywhere with that. Jale stale jo antarikhe, tridha mukti in chasukare. But one point, it is a general you know, Siddhanta. But now special Siddhanta is there that in Varanasham, you know, Kasi Maranat Mukti. If you die in Varanasi, surely Mukti you can get. But there is surety you must understand this Siddhanta. In Varanasi, if you die, you cannot get direct Mukti, but gradual, gradual. I mean, you can you can get the scope to get mukti. Next you can do. Next you can do. gradual, not direct. Follow. So mukti is there. Also Bhagwati Devi can also give mukti. Mukti, but gradual, not direct. You know, mukti because mukti data Vishnu Reva na sangsayo. Without Vishnu, direct mukti nobody can give. Follow what I say. And prem, love, Krishna prem is only possible for Krishna and Chaitanya Mahaprabhu. Vishnu, if coming, not cannot give. Baradev can come, no. Nishingo Dev, no. No. Ami bina Krishna prem jita nahi shakti. So this way, this way, Siddhanto, you know, so mukti data in sastra is confirmed. Only Vishnu can give him. mukti data Vishnu Deva na sangsayo. So Sonatun Goswami writing there also okay. Tato Brahmadhi Brahmadhi Tato Ato Brahmadhi Sangpartho 
मुक्तिदान आधिकारितम भवते भवत्वई चादुर्गा वही भगवान आदात दे आर गिविंग स्पेशल पावर टू यू बिकॉज ए रेस्पेक्ट लव यू वेरी मच सो नाउ एक्चुअली नारद जी महाराज वन बाई वन गोइंग टू गिव आर्गुमेंट वन बाई इट्स नॉट आर्गुमेंट गोइंग टू प्रे टू शंकर यू गोइंग टू डिनाई बट वी हैव सो मेनी डॉक्यूमेंट्स दैट यू आर द एक्चुअल कृपा पात्र अहो ब्रह्मादि दुष्प्राप्ये ऐश्वर्ये सती अपी ईशे तत्सर्व सुखम ओपी आत्मनम अनादृत अवधूत वत् भवाविष्ट सदा विष्णोर मोहन मादो गृहित वत् को अन्यम को अन्यम पत्नसम नृत्य गणरोपी दिगंबरा आई कैन एक्सप्लेन दिस लोक टुमरो बट आई एम गोइंग टू गिव एन स्केच लाइन नारिजमा स्पीकिंग इम्पॉसिबल दिस काइंड ऑफ अप्लायंस ग्रांटेड बाय भगवान टू यू व्हिच इज नॉट पॉसिबल इन ब्रह्म लोका दिस काइंड ऑफ अप्लायंस व्हिच इज इम्पॉसिबल टू फाइंड इन ब्रह्म लोका हियर एंड देयर this kind of great appliances granted by bhagwan to you but that is your excellency that you are going to ignore we would like to lead your life very simple way like a, a, a simple man simple very simple aho brahma dis stop boy sir yo your aisa jo appliances great sati opi she follow you have ishita actually it is true that shankar bhagwan his position is more important than brahma more more important than brahma why why and how i will like to explain to more aho brahma di dusprape oi sarje sati opishe tat sarvam sukham opi atmanam anadritta avadhuta va you are leading your life like a avadhut like sanyasi you know Like avadut, no appliance. You are not enjoying anything. Shankar Bhagwan is very famous for for his loveful detachment. Who not? Everybody loves Shankar. From my childhood, I love because I know he is so detachment. But now I understand <laughs> little by the mercy of Guru Dev. Oh, detachment is not big factor, but detachment, Krishna Pitarthe Bhogte. Detachment, everything, and somebody can have, but it is what it concerns to us. Detachment for the satisfaction of Krishna. I like to arrange all satisfaction to my Prabhu. Whatever flower and fruit, what is you know, I can offer to Krishna that you can give to Krishna. What is not possible to offer to Krishna that you can give to me. Eh? Forest flower, this a dirty flower, you can give to me. I am very satisfied. That's why. You know, Shankar Bhagwan taking all useless girl and everything. Of course, if you give nice flower, you know, I offer nice flowers. That not that is usually Bhagwan going to appoint, not taking. Bhagwan already declared all good, good, nice, nice thing in the whole material world. Wherever what good thing available, all I offer to Bhagwan, my Prabhu. Only what nobody going to touch. That thing you can offer to me. i am very satisfied satisfaction is bhakti i cannot satisfy you by giving donation these there so many thing satisfaction only one point if we have devotion bhakti devotional mood automatically satisfaction can come to touch your heart to give transcendental bliss without bhakti whatever thing you are getting whatever you are going to arrange Nothing can give you satisfaction. Nothing. Aho Brahma di dus prapte ay sarje sati apiye tat sarvam shukham opi atmanam anadrit abadhuto bad bhava vishtha shada vishnor mahan mahan madh grihito bad. You are leading your life less like a madman. You are totally, you know, full of love, bhava vishto. 
your heart and soul, inside, outside, everywhere you can discover your Prabhu. Everywhere. Baba Vishto. You cannot see this material world. You are deep into the feeling of Krishna Seva. It is, you know, it is fact. Oh, I know you are going to ignore me. No, I will know. Who is going? We can find nobody who is going to dance and sing like you with, with, like you with wife. Even you cannot remember the, your, your clothes gone. You are naked. Even you cannot understand the yoga cloth. In Bhagavatam it is written, Jatha Madira Madandho. In Bhagavatam it is written, when somebody drinking too much liquor, wine, after that cannot understand that, that uh, garment is there in body or not, cloth gone or not. This kind of example given in Bhagavatam. Jatha Madira Madandho. So follow what I say. This way, you know, Baba Vishto, all the time. You cannot remember that your cloth gone from your body. This is your love. Now you are going to, you know, you are going to deny. We know everything, all your glory. So, we repent for the whole world. This kind of nectarian flow of, you know, Brihat Bhagavatam Vita Bhagavan giving to us, Sanatana Gosai. We don't want to drink. Ascharja meta di himanus saloke, Sudham paritajya bisam pivanti, Namani nara yono go chorani, Taktani, Taktanavachaha kuhaka patanti. Ascharja meta himanus saloke. In human world, we find everybody like to throw out nectar, they like to drink poison, to die commit suicide. And we all try to save them. Ascharja meta dhimanu saloke sudham paritajya visam pivanti namani nara yano go charani taktyannavachaha ava taktyannavachaha kuvaka patanti Bancha kalpaturvasya ke pasindu bhavacha patitanang pavana bhavashna bhyo namo namo.